All right, coming up, may I present to you a married couple that hasn't had a fight in decades. Can you believe it? Well, this, these relationship experts, they're breaking down the three keys to a successful marriage. Smiling is one of them, I think. We'll be right back. Now to some sage advice that many of us could probably use, the secrets to a healthy marriage. Well, our next guests are good people to ask about that. Authors Dr. Willie Jolly and his wife, Dee Taylor Jolly, have been married for 37 years, and they tell us they haven't had a fight in 35 years. Uh-huh. Uh, <laughs> together, they share their wisdom online in their weekly Jolly wow. Marriage Show, and they're here with us in the studio. Dr. Willie, Dee, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. First things right out of the box, 37 years. No fights in 35. What were those first two years like? <laughs> <laughs> World War Three. <III. laughs> We had not figured it out. Yeah, well, first, we want to thank you for having us. Of course. And then we want to thank God for the opportunity to be able to hopefully help some marriages not just survive, but thrive. Mm -hmm. So the answer is that people ask all the time, have you really been, you know, 35 years without arguing? Yeah. But before I answer that question, I want to first give statistics. So most marriages break up within seven years, mm -hmm. statistically. Right. Most divorces happen. 50% of marriages in America break up, as we all know. And then of the 50%, that remain 40% of them are miserable mm. so why are they together yeah mm. is it the money is it until the kids are 18 or out of the house mm. you don't really know but they're miserable but they don't have to be okay well let's right. dig what, in what are the three major pressure points well, in a marriage before I get there I want to make we're gonna sure we're going to run out of time so you got to get there I know we're going to get there <laughs> uh, yeah. but I want to give you these couple of things first first of where that it is true that we have not had an in, a, a, a argument in over 35 years. Now, those first couple of years were like World War III. But <laughs> some people misunderstand that or they mishear that. They say, you've never had an argument? No, that's not true. We have had an argument. We, we've learned some wise systems from mentors. And we, I say something in my speeches that I want people to hear. There are two ways to get to any goal, mentors and mistakes. If you... Uh, you, you don't do them, you're going to end up with knots upside your head. So you want to have mentors. And what we did was wrote a book that's a book of mentor systems that works. And, and, and this was not a book we were planning to write, was right. it? No. Our son encouraged us because he would talk to his friends and he would say, well, I never heard my parents argue. And they was like, that's a lie. So what are so oh. what are so what do couples need to keep in mind? So I don't want to run out of time. Well, what, what couples need to keep in mind is there are three pressure points: mm -hmm. sex, money, communication. communication, which is the common thread through all of it. Do the mm -hmm. sex and the money. What if you have different styles of communication? Some people want to talk it out immediately. My husband wants to go and think about it. I'm like, I don't want you to think about it. I want to talk about it now. Well, the different styles of communication. The key is that you get systems. So what we talked about in the book is systems. You know, let me say this: I've been blessed to be able to speak to major corporations all over the world. I wrote the book, A Setback, Set Up for a Comeback. And I'm grateful that I've been able to travel and I have, uh, I'm part of the syndicated morning show, Get Up Mornings with Erica Campbell. I have my XM show. But we have found that there are systems that work, that make your marriage work. And see, many people have bad systems like stonewalling. <laughs> I'm, I'm done talking. Or the silent treatment. Bad. Or I think you should know what I'm thinking. Those are bad systems. So you have to listen. So if one says, I'm not going to talk, Another says, I want to talk and I want to run after you. You have to take a deep breath mm -hmm. and you have to be willing to listen and have patience. So communication is the biggest problem in marriage. It's the biggest problem in marriage. So what we did when we wrote the book, the biggest chapter is communication. So we give that chapter away to any and everybody because we want to save a million marriages and enhance a million marriages. How do you give it away? Well, go to ajollymarriage.com, ajollymarriage.com, okay. and get that chapter. And if you get the book, get two copies, one for each of you, or get the audio book so that y'all can together. grow together. Okay. And the okay. next time you're back, We'll talk about sex. We, we, got, really sex. we got a whole Thank lot to talk about sex. Thank you. All right, Absolutely. All right.